hi again. I hope that you all are healthy and happy. I am so excited for the very first podcast that I have tried to do. So I got this idea from one of my teacher. He jokingly said to me that he will write an essay on me because I always sat on the same corner seat. And he also gave me a title that said Amy and the Corner Seat. <laughs> and I am grateful for the reason that I was able to turn this title into a poetry of my imagination um, or some experience. So this is me on the corner seat. While drowning in the sea, you were not thinking of me. Drowning in the thoughts of beauty and its originality. Not caring about the worlds, surpassing all the hurdles. Hopping on the clouds of contentment with patience and admiration. Happiness was in fantasy. Looking up to moon shining. You slept with fairy tales and woke up with jet reality. But that was not the end of your dream. You were still craving for cookies and cream. With all your heart, you were lifting yourself with brave heart and a bold smile. Because you were the one, always there for yourself. When no one else was there, you get the medals on your shelf. When all these thoughts were in her head, she rolled her eyes and fell to stare. While gaining the strength to be in a world, the queen was made strong and bold. Her throne was the corner seat where she found herself admiring gratitude and fulfillment. Hunger for satisfaction and peace ended with a chop hitting her cheek. She felt the calm atmosphere around before the harsh counter made her realize that it was just an imagination. The power of mind I was abrupt, as the imagination in her head was plucked. An angry creature moved towards her and made her eyes fewer and blur. With the passing time, she heard the clock ticking. Her heart skipped a beat as she felt the attacks of questionnaire showering. The sweet smile started to fade when she was ordered to look in the eyes like a maid. Oh, the bell rang. She heard the rush accompanying a slime. Gathering her magical tools, she packed the door of her fantasy and ran like she was the central of a story, but without the prince and the beautiful rings. This was just a pause as the gate of her dreams opened with a snore and a rose. Yet, every day with a new sunshine, the corner seat was blamed for the magic and the mind.